I don't know how to start a video, but I'm hopeless, and this is Stardew Valley Doing It All episode 41. So, uh, I know it's gonna... gonna trigger some of you guys. You, you guys are gonna have, like, mild seizures about this, but, uh, I decided that there's not much left to do in winter, so rather than, like, trying to stay up, until midnight every single night get the most done. I'm just sleeping through like I do the few things that I need to do each day You know feed the chickens uh, Attend this event Give people gifts, but other than that I just basically sleep right away, so uh, You know try not to be too offended at this I'm just trying to move the series along so we can get back to doing interesting things that actually help us complete the challenge Of course, you know giving people gifts does help us complete the challenge, but like I said, I'm still doing that even though I sleep immediately after doing that. But, uh, we're, we're moving it along. And the end of this video is at the end of winter. So next video, we're back in spring. And there's a few things we need to get done in spring. But for the most part, we're just gonna get things done in summer. Spring, basically, all that's gonna happen is I'm gonna plant some crops. Like, a bunch of crops, basically. And, uh... You know, that's that's pretty much it. Like, I'm gonna grow a bunch of crops and try to make some money going into summer. In summer, I'm going to plant an apple tree, which I'll definitely be able to afford. I'm going to plant the red cabbage, grow that. I'll plant it up near the rare crow so that, you know, it doesn't die. Uh, in summer, we'll also, well, like, spring and summer, we'll be upgrading our barn, getting our pig grown, getting the truffle. So we can do that at any time, and then basically all that's left after that is we have to get to fall, get a yam, get... We'd already have the truffle, and we would have the, uh... We'd have the barn, so we'll be able to buy a goat, and if we can buy a goat... Like, hey, here's my thinking here. We have to get up to a deluxe barn anyways to get a pig. So we'll, while we have the large barn or whatever it's called, the, the big barn, we might as well get a goat because a goat, a uh, large goat milk can be used to finish up the animal bundle. So we'll use the large goat milk to finish up the animal bundle. We'll use the truffle to finish up the chef bundle. We'll use the red cabbage to finish up the dye bundle. That'll happen in summer. We need three apples, which is in fall to finish the fodder bundle, and we need one apple to finish up the artisan bundle. And then, also in fall, we have to plant 10 beets, and put those 10 beets into Mayor Lewis's fridge, at which point we can continue the master, or mysterious master key, or whatever it's called. Uh, you know, we can get into the casino, basically. From there we can get the rare crow, uh, we have to plant a yam and grow it in fall so that we can finish the fall crops bundle, and then I think that's basically all of the bundles done. So we're getting really close, uh, like I said I'm basically gonna start skipping through days once we can, y you know, to the extent where I'll get the things done that I need to do each day, but I'm trying to like move this series along, get it finished, because otherwise this series is gonna take forever if I keep doing three days to a video. Then it'll take, like, another, uh, 20 episodes, probably. And the 20 episodes would be mostly doing nothing, so... Rather than doing nothing for 20 episodes... Uh, just, you know... I'm gonna do more days per episode. I'll probably stop feeding the chickens, or just sell the chickens, and sell the coops, when, uh... Basically at any point here, honestly. We only need mayonnaise to give to Haley, but if we can max out Haley's hearts, then we don't need mayonnaise anymore. And while it's a nice source of income, it's also costing us a bit because we have to buy the hay. So it costs us 8 times 50, I think. So about 400 gold per day. We do get more gold than that by selling the mayonnaise that we make. Like, you know, just selling two mayonnaise even gets more than that. But at the same time, we can skip through days faster if we don't have to deal with chickens. So we'll probably sell all that and then build up our barn, get a goat, get a pig, and just skip through the days until we can get to summer and fall where everything that we need to do has to happen. 
Other than that, uh, not a whole lot left to do. I'm trying to, like, remember to not give people gifts if I'm already maxed out, but it's just a reflex at this point where I, I see them, and I know I haven't given them a gift, so I give them a gift. It doesn't really cost us anything other than time, because we just have to walk back to the house anyways and get more wallpapers out of the, uh, the catalog there. But at the same time, you know, it'd probably be better if I just stopped giving them gifts. I think I have, like, three people maxed out right now. I've got, like, Abigail maxed out, I've got Leia maxed out, and I don't think I've maxed out any of the non-bachelors or bachelorettes. Although the closest is Linus, I believe. Linus has nine hearts, and then there might be another person with nine hearts. Although I could be thinking of Penny, who does have nine hearts, and we're going to marry her in the spring as soon as it rains, basically. Shouldn't be too hard. And we can give, once you get married, you can give your spouse a gift every single day. So we'll be able to quickly get to 13 hearts with Penny. But other than that, we're coming up on the end of the video. So I hope you guys are still enjoying the series. If you are, remember to leave a like, leave a comment. And if you aren't already subscribed, I really recommend it. It helps out a whole bunch. And you get these videos straight to your inbox every day at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. But other than that, I will see you guys all next time.